Roland Dale, The Twits. Chapter 1, Hairy Faces. What a lot of hairy faced men there are around nowadays. When a man grows hair all over his face, it's impossible to tell what he really looks like. Perhaps that's why he does does it. You rather like you don't know. And then there's a problem washing. When the very hairy ones wash their faces, it must be as big as a job as when I wash the hair on your on your heads. So what I want to know is this. How often do all these hairy faced men wash their faces? Is it only once a week, like us on Sunday nights? And do they shampoo it? Do they use hair dryer? Use a hair dryer? Do they rub hair tonic in to stop fa- their faces from going bald? Do they go to a barber? Do they have hairy faces cut and trimmed? Or do they do it themselves in front of the bathroom mirror with nail scissors? I don't know. The next time you see a man with a hairy face, which will probably be as soon as you step out on the street, maybe you could look at him more closely and start wondering about some of these things. Chapter 2. Mr. Twit. Mr. Twit was one of the very, these very hairy men, faced men. A hole his face is set for his forehead. His eyes, his nose, is covered with thick hair. The stuff that sprouted into rolling tufts out of his nostrils and ear holes. And Mr. Twit felt his hairlessness made him look terrifically wise and grand. In truth, in neither of these things, Mr. Twit was a twit. He was born a twit, and now at the age of sixty, he was a bigger twit than ever. The hair Mr. Twit's face didn't grow smooth, and much as it didn't, does not mo- does most hairy faced men, hairy faced men. It grew in spikes that stuck out straight like the bristles of a nail brush. How often did Mr. Twit wash the bristly, narrow, nail brushy face of his? The answer is never, not even on Sundays. He hadn't washed it for years. Broke chapter three, dirty beards. And you know, an ordinary unhairy face like yours or mine simply gets a bit smudgy if not washed often enough. There's nothing so awful about that. With a hairy face, is very, it's a very different matter. Being clean to hairs, especially food. Things like gravy, so great, right. Into the, the, among the hairs. Go right in among the hairs and stay there. You and I can wipe your face smooth. Your our smooth faces with fennel. They quickly look more or less all right again, but the hairy men cannot do that. 